Okay, I have no idea how this is going to turn out at all, but I've been inspired. So, yeah, I am going to do this. Don't know how good it's going to be, but my poetry is genius. Um, this is my first time doing this, so I apologize if it just is, if it just, yeah. If it don't work out right the first few times, I want it to be perfect, but I know that there's a god awful noise in the background because, like, I've got cheap stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is a cheap computer. This ain't even my internet. Um, and I've never done this before. Never done this before. But, I want to share with y'all some poetry, because I've been inspired. So, yeah. The first poem I'm going to do, like, and I'm about to remove the screen, so I'm not even going to be able to see myself. Might be a good thing, because I feel silly right now. Why am I sad, people? <laughs> okay, anyway, let's see. First poem I'm going to do is called Memories. Bear with me. <laughs> I hope this is still recording. Bear with me. Okie dokie. I'm trying to find it. I believe I found it. Okay, this is called Memories. And just so y'all know, I really am going through a lot. <laughs> a lot. So, this was wrote September 14th, 2014. Okay. <clears throat> Memories are haunting me, so I'm going back in time. Crazy, quite possibly, so all I could think to do is rhyme. Who am I? I'm the one who once wrote. All the many theoretical conflicts of existing are as parables of nonsense. I'm living. That is my favorite of all my quotes, although I forgot how to live. At one point in time, I also wrote this. If you see something spooky, are you the type to scream and run? It's guaranteed if you consume me, I'm like a psychedelic drug. Who am I now? What happened to me? Maybe you can see through me, maybe it's just luck. Maybe I taught you too much and you don't know what to do with me. Through my poetry, everyone knows me. My public persona has become a tough shell to crack. Just know my soul is deep. What is this front or mask I had to adapt to when I was under attack? I'm clueless, are you? I once had all the answers. Maybe that's the problem. They were questions I no longer care for, so I must be more careful. I feel haunted by this what not a god spin. All the possibilities. On the inside, I'm screaming, now what, what if, what then? I'm even talking to myself like, the problem will be solved. When? The answers are inside you, so dig within. Even with my problems, I got this. Maybe my memories deceive me. Maybe this whole time I've been being me. I've just been growing so it shows differently. Let's travel back in time and create in our own minds a paradigm. Then let it rewind again and watch, and watch it shift. Just so I could say, hey, I got this. It's a paradigm shift. It's not the apocalypse. Even if it is, I still got this. Not to be too optimistic, but at this point I've got to be a mystic to get through this. <clears throat> Where am I at? Okay. I wish it were more blissful and mystical, but at least it's not as typical as the far distant and cry of a pitiful mind. I believe these are critical times. On that note, who am I to whine about all that is wrong with me? Obviously, there is a much bigger story unfolding. Obviously, it's not just me. I do not care what who told me. I trust me. Even when life has you by the throat, breathe. Even when lonely, there is something holding me. On that note, I shall take each step boldly. I am not saying I'm not terrified, because I am. But I'll be damned if I let myself remain damaged and let life and my time pass me by. I'm a Sagittarius. I'm a fire sign. 
I have a mission divine and I have a purpose. <coughs> Sorry. I lost my spot again. This stupid thing. Okay. Where am I at? Okay. Alright, I'm a Sagittarius, I'm a fire sign, I have a mission divine, and I have a purpose. I am not cursed and I am worth it. Memories are only memories, and that I am sure of. I am a poet, I am supposed to write. Life is not meaningless. Even if you disagree with the rest of this, I still have you thinking. <laughs> Jesus, she's a poetic genius. The best is yet to come. Be patient, let me live some. My memories will be my gun to not only overcome, but to help anyone who is their biggest enemy, and then some. The dictionary of memories is a picture image of clarity, if everything is intact. Just remember that. Okay, now I am going to read with you something I wrote the other day. If I could find it. Everything is ghetto. Every <laughs> I'm in a, a, a hillbilly ghetto. I really am. I'm in a hillbilly ghetto. Um. And yes, there is such a thing. Okay. This is called. <coughs> but the truth is. By me. Cannon Star Macaulay. Okay. What is the mystery here? What do I fear? What's unclear? Endless visions, which one makes the most sense? Until then, I sit here, trying to put the, every piece together. Victory or failure? How can one be both bound and free? Have I found me? Questions dance through my brain like an intelligent mess. Dare I test the quest? What is the message here? What lies deep within the mystery? What in existence penetrates the whole soul, bringing us all aglow, only to blow up and integrate the oh no? And so on, so it goes, with stories untold as it all unfolds before our eyes, like we really are living to die. It's like a snake bite. Maybe the entire thing is just a fake fight, as we are all trapped in something we call time that doesn't even exist. Do I exist? Do you? <laughs> is, is it all really a dream? What do you really see? Maybe it is I who can't see through your eyes. All the almost seemingly sinister adventures of a girl on a mission in search for a ridiculous whirlwind. What might this whirlwind be? A peaceful freedom, wisdom seeking, a mission worth bleeding for. A symbol of mystery and lore. Somehow I have the answers, but they are a blur. I shall twist the visions and turn them until the picture image is perfect. At a mere glimpse of my story, you can tell that I drifted into this shit by a gift that burned me. They say the shift warned me, but did it really? Beyond infinite wisdom springs a wish of... <laughs> that's just it. A wish of what? What exactly? And they say all will work out in perfect timing. I used to dodge the blast. Now I intentionally absorb them, just so I shall become stronger. Give me water, I go farther, on into tomorrow. That brings us back to soul. They see me as some sort of hero, but they don't even know that my heart isn't even near whole. Focus on which road? An alien Native American Christian witch? <laughs> yeah, so what so? Wolves of religion? is a no-go. Everything of the spirit is golden. All is not hopeless. It's not hocus pocus. Focus. Am I in search for a soulmate? No, not really. Not until I am whole. I'm searching for friends, maybe romance, to the most a slow dance with benefits, or someone to hold for a moment if given the chance. Now, well will always be my best friend, but under the circumstance, everything she can't know. I could put a I could put on quite a show, but I'm going through stuff and nobody knows. So focus on which road. <laughs> fuck it, I so fuck it. I'll switch the whole thing up like. A, 
fuck it. I'll switch the whole thing up like a finished masterpiece in the abyss of the hole. Sit freely. They'll think it's bitch mode. It's a twisted road, but I'm a twisted soul. Didn't you know? <laughs> I have the gifts to uplift and cure the broken. But if I come within an inch of feeling swollen, <laughs> never mind. That's my secret to keep. Stay out of my business, reaping and weep. I have too much shit within I need to seek. Solar, Sagittarian, Lunar, Aquarian, but my Mars is in Scorpio. It's leaking out like a beast. <laughs> I am a fucking dragon, though. <laughs> my body, this life, is only for show. The owl is my life totem, the snake is my shadow. I've also been known to follow the crow. But nothing compares to the day I turned into a dragon and burned that entity to ashes. Yes, I'm speaking in riddles. If you get it, fantastic. It's the gifts of magic. It's a scent of tragedy bleeding into the formation of a race for something untouched just so it can later become both fate and love. Who, what, why, when, where, and how. It's all unsolved. I forgot all my knowledge of the Kabbalah, Pollyanna, and the Bodhisattvas. I'm stuck with Baba Yaga. All I know is I conquer battles. I think I'm beginning to love the trust of Saturn. Look at it like a pattern. Go through it until you get it. Soulful music is at the end of it. Even if no one is listening but you. Do what you've got to do. For now I come in peace and love. This is my kingdom come. But it seems I'm done for now, so I shall take a bow. Okay. Now, I see myself now. Okay. Um... Now to see how I did. I'm nervous. I'm nervous, 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 nervous. <laughs> Keep in mind. <laughs> my son, Sagittarius in the fifth house. My Saturn, Sagittarius in the fifth house. Plus my mid heaven and north node in Aries, which I don't, I only see that when I'm working, <laughs> and i am just now been able to do that within the past maybe year or so, I'm 26, I'll be 27 soon, it's, it's September 22nd right now, so I got a couple months, I'm getting old, I look young though, um, Boy, let's see how silly I did. Or maybe it was amazing, but I doubt it. I'll get amazing, though. I just got to build up some money, get some cool little equipment going on. And, yeah. Who knows? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Actually, I'm not going to get up because there's a mess behind me.